YouTube, how's it going? My name's Ali, and I'm bringing you a brand new video. Now we're going to talk about Call of Duty Champs groups, since the group were just drawn last night. Um, as you guys can see on the screen, those are all the groups, so I'm going to start talking about from group A to H, who I think is going to happen, who are going to be the top two in each group. All right, in group A, you got Optic, Epsilon, Echo Fox, and Threes Up. To me, this is a very stacked group. Like, Optic Gaming, I think, will come out first easily. But Epsilon or Echo Fox, I don't know which one to pick, but I'm going to go with Echo Fox just because Epsilon had a really bad stage two. And then you got Group B with Team Envious, Elevate, Project Evil, and Mind Freak Black. And this one's I think, is a little easier. Team Envious will get first. Elevate sucks right now. They went 0-18 in maps in stage two. And so I'm going to pick Project Evil to win that. And so I think Team Envious and Project Evil will come out of there. And then the Group C, you got E United, Mind Freak, Infused, and Rogue. To me, this is a hard one because Rogue is a really dominant team in the qualifier. And I think Infuse is good. And I, Mind Freak is so inconsistent. I don't know how they're going to perform. But E United will get the first seed no matter what. And then I'm going to go with Rogue to get the second seed in that. And then you got Group D with Luminosity, Rise, Supremacy, and Vitality. So Rise has been inconsistent throughout the year. They were good in the beginning of the year, then they just fell off. But I think that Luminosity will get first, and I think Rise will perform in champs, and they'll get the second seed. All right, and then you got Group E with Phase, Red Reserve, Allegiance, and Arrow. This is a tough group, too. You got Phase, I think, will get first, but don't... I won't be surprised because Red Reserve can upset them. Same with Allegiance. Allegiance was dominant in the qualifier. I'm going to pick FaZe to come out and Allegiance in that group. Because I just think Allegiance is better than Red Reserve. And then Group F. Now, this is all the weak teams in one group. So, like, they're not super weak, but like straight ripping can take the first seed in here. Same with Evil Genius, same with Fnatic. Tam Mines, I don't think they'll do anything. This is between them three. I think Straight Ripping is going to get the first seed, and I think Fnatic is going to get the second seed. And then you got Group G with Spice, Ghost Gaming, Millennium, and Lethal. I think that uh, Spice should be able to get the first seed. They're a dominant team. They've just been a little inconsistent right now. And then I don't think Millennium will show up. I don't think Lethal will show up, so I'm going to say Ghost will get the second. And then you got Group H with E6, Cloud9, MRN Black, and TK. TK got a hard group. If TK was like where Tame Mines or Era was, they might have a chance. But MRN Black sucks, so they could get the third seed if they wanted to. But E6 and Cloud9, I don't see them losing to either of them too. So to me, it's going to be a fight for first. Will E6 be able to beat Clown Nine or will Clown Nine be able to beat E6? I think E6 will win. I think E6 will get the first seed and Clown Nine will get the second seed. But yeah, that's what I think. To go over again, I think Optic and Echo Fox will come out Group A. Team Envious and Project Evil will come out Group B. Group C, E United and Rogue. Group D, Luminosity Rise. Group E, Phase and Allegiance. Group F, Straight Rippin' and Fnatic. Group G, Splice and Ghost. And Group H, E6 and Cloud9. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys later.